Hi, today I'm showcasing interactive videos, interactive videos on the iPad. Anyone can actually watch this and anyone can create them. I'm offering is the truth, nothing more. guy's really close. Are you serious? What's up with this dude? Oh boy, here he comes. That's what happens when they give the camera to my little cousin. this guy right here good boy now fuck off Jones, how are you going to find that statue in all this junk? If Marcus' approximations are accurate, it should be pretty close. Although, he got lost in his own museum once or twice. A replica of the cross. 
Cross of Coronado. The original is now in a museum where it belongs. <laughs> Brings back memories of my father and what we went through together. It's a medieval gargoyle or a good imitation. People back then were well aware of the battle between good and evil. All these things that we can't explain. So there you are. This is interactive video with the VBML language, a very streamlined and, and simple language that uh, enables you to come up with this kind of video from a single track, from a single video track, uh, along with the new AI video tools that we've seen recently. So the combination of the two uh, is bringing interesting results, in my opinion. You can navigate through them using the, the player, like that, go back to the first one. And uh, the interactivity is quite... Uh, is quite strong. You can even store um, specific states so that you can apply them later on on the timeline. So the level on, of, of interactivity could be surprisingly good and coupled with uh, derivative AI that we now have and that and the improvement that we'll see in the in the near future, I believe that interactive video might become very, very interesting yet again. And so looking forward to that. If you want to try that, uh, you can scan this video, this video tag here, or you can type omega.gg, omega.gg, and there just download the monkey application or the motion box application, motion box, which is entirely GPL based on LGPL code source, source code. And let me know what you think. If you're interested in creating one of these, let me know on the Discord channel. I regularly check that one and I can uh, show you a very simple tutorial. I can guide you through the process of creating a very simple interactive video uh, with your own video clips. So yeah, that's interactive video on the iPad. Thank you for your attention.